Hello everybody, my name is Parak and in today's video we're finally going to get to the Gunlance without any wirebug skills or wirebug attacks. Pretty much anything that costs wirebugs we are not using except for the recovery stuff. And unfortunately for me, my preferred fight with Gunlance is Primordial Malzino. So let's go see how it goes. Of course I've got the guard up to 10. I got redirection of course. It's just going to be fighting instinct to not try and reverse dash through things to deal extra damage. As well as to get, you know, Blast Dash up quickly because otherwise it takes quite a bit to cast it or like start it up. Okay, can we land damage off Roars? Beautiful. Okay. That is a horrible sign that I missed that immediately. That's okay. That. Oh my god, I already have to fight Instinct to actually press my damage button. Nope. That way. Go. Okay, we've got some damage. The Thrust. I guess I mistimed it. Block. Okay, that's fine. Also brought double cat just to give me a bit of extra healing. So hopefully I get a bit more uptime from having them help me heal. But we'll see. Beautiful. I have wanted to reverse dash back to him so badly. Block that. Get over to him. Okay, it's fine. There. That's fine as well. That way, blast dash him. Okay. So we actually have a decent bit of openings if I can actually time anything. We have decent openings here with Gun Lance. I just need to stop getting hit because that's the main problem is I'm just constantly getting hit. So we can't keep Heaven Center or anything active. That's okay. We'll make it work. Some damage. Get that active if I can. Oh, we got it just in time. Okay. I also need to utilize our... Wyvern Blast, Wyvern Blast, this thing. Because we definitely have it. Cancel with reverse, or not reverse dash, any button but that. Redirection. Oh my god, I wanted to... <laughs> it's so hard to fight the instinct to press reverse dash. Of course that hit me, that's okay though. Poke into that. Fine. No sir. Hopefully he does poke, which he did. He's given us a lot of openings with it, which is good. Nope. Kitnader, yes sir. Give me that. It'll be a fantastic knockdown for me. As we can just spam... Okay. I was trying to turn around with it, but that's okay. But yeah, we can just slip, spam the slam. Get some vials that way. One more. And... There. Way too early. Does his orbs. He did not do his orbs. He's gonna do it now. He did not do orbs at all. That's unfortunate. He usually backs up and does orbs off that first transition. I thought I was too early, but it works. That way, he does the second one, because phase two. Get him. Okay. Not too bad, not too bad. Poke into that. Dodge it. Nope. Dash towards him. Okay, we do actually have time off that. Good, good, good. Nope. Don't want to get grabbed by that. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. We can dodge past him, we'd be good. Does orbs, we block it, and then he can poke off it. But he decided not to. Oh, little slow on my input. There. Am I safe up here? I am so surprised I was actually safe. Especially with the hitboxes in this game. Specifically the aerial hitboxes. I was very surprised about that. May as well get some more damage off that. Redirection to cancel it. Get away. Nice and simple. Some more. Poke as well. Okay, good, good, good. I'm guessing he didn't reach me because it didn't block either. That was interesting. That was some very weird placements. But we take those. Nope. Try again. Can he go back to doing the other stuff? That would be fantastic. On top of me. There. No! Oh, I lost Heaven Sent because he ran too far. It's alright, we'll get the Powder Mantle. Go slightly to the side and dash towards him. Unfortunate. Oh my god, I, I want to reverse dash to him so bad. But I can't! So we just do this instead. Get that active because we're doing melee swings, so may as well. Get a bit of extra damage on those swings. 
fine. Block it. Get some damage. Nice and simple. And the mount. Beautiful. That's going to be a good chunk of free damage. But we're not going to have any shells. So that's fun. Ooh, water blight. Hopefully not ruined by something bad over here. Nothing. Let's go. Water blight for me. We need to poke into shell and then blast towards him. Nice and simple. Get the combo going. Oh, that's unfortunate that he took his face off the ground, but it is what it is. Good stagger. Poke to cancel it. There. Okay, beautiful. We had enough iframes to go through the tail as well. Sneak attack damage. Beautiful stuff. Alright, what's he doing? Big slam. He missed us. I, I have no idea how he misses there, but that's okay. That into the orbs. We should be able to block all this. We've got guard 10. That should be the last one. Damage. Oh my god, of course he did. Why wouldn't he go for a grab off that? That's alright. I should have just not gone for the follow-up, but it usually comes out a bit faster than most things. So that was the game plan. Okay, should take a second there. And the cats are healing me. Oh. We'll take that free slap. Nice. Oh, I did have Heaven Sent. Let's go. There. And there. And there. Oh, I missed it. Plus dash. <laughs> I don't know why I wasn't doing it. There. Too early. Okay. It's so hard to not press the button. I swear, man. If you haven't played, like, reverse dash playstyle, or the playstyle that I usually use here, it's really hard to not press the buttons, because it's basically the way that you deal damage. And I just can't do that. Even off that, I'd usually do it instead, because it's just faster. Go past him. Orbs. Oh, I was too early. But at least I got to reload. We've also got the uh, Anomaly Blight active, or Blood Blight. So we can get some extra damage. From being able to just heal instead of oh it's gone already that was quick back it up manual reload okay that was seven cent so it wasn't far but i definitely didn't have it yet slap into breath or not let's get some damage on him should take a second there into that one poke into that orbs and then he runs over Cross slash. That's fine. He didn't teleport. Go. <laughs> I swear I'm pressing it earlier. Just to guess it can't come out that fast. See, I'm holding it and it's not doing anything. I don't actually know what that is. Because I feel like the animation should start. But it's just not. Nope. Second one. That way. Blast him. Good. Uh oh. Okay, good. We didn't take a free hit there, because I messed up an input. That's fine, there. Why haven't blast this? Why not? Bang. No stun. Unfortunate. Just guard poke him a bit, try and hit the face. That's a hard knockback. Should be able to block these. Nice and simple. Oh, we didn't get the stun. That's alright. I'll take it. Bonk. There. Had to wait for his face to come back. Nice and simple. Bread and butter combos. Keep hitting the face. It missed, unfortunately. That's fine. Raw. Oh, I lost. Okay. Again, I think I just got too far from him. So, we lost Heaven Sent on the uh, knockdown. Ooh. Just got it. Shield slam. That's fine. See, I'm... It's starting it, but it's not actually doing anything out of it. So I'm not actually crazy in seeing that. The character's doing the animation and then not doing the rest. I wonder why that is. Ooh. Get out of there. It's fine. That way. I wanted to get my vault. See? I, I don't know what's happening there. Okay. Eh. Eh. Nope. Shield slam. 
No shield slam. That's fine with me. Let me get some damage into that. I think that's last phase. It is last phase. Poke him. He's going to do his combo. I don't think I can land any damage here without redirection. So I'm just going to chase him down how you normally would to avoid this stuff. Maybe there. Nah, that wasn't worth it at all. Woo! The chip damage. That's alright though. Should heal plenty here. Hopefully at least. Oh my god. Of course Blood Blight wore off instantly again. That's alright. We get some slaps. Into another one. No sir. Still need shockwave stuff. There. Woo! We actually had to go through that because I'm pretty sure I don't have guard up on this set. It's just regular guard. So uh, that would have hurt a lot. Nope. Okay. Nope. And nope. Oh my god. Let's go Wabuki. Get some damage on him. Into a slap. We've already got our buff so I may as well do some more. Like our buff to extra damage. Doing his nuke again. It's the bad nuke this time. It's alright though. We can just block all this. It's a cute nuke for you, mate. His lasers. That's fine. We're not going to hit him unless I get, like, Powder Mental randomly. Which isn't going to happen, because you obviously need to hit the monster to build up the stacks. But that's alright. It does this. We get our damage. Nice and simple. Get our buff into these. Down slam into a slap. Into another one. Nice and simple. He's blue. Oh, dodge through it. Thanks to that extra bit of evasion from the uh, evade extender. Okay, poke him. Get the powder mantle. Poke him some more. Because I don't think I have time to blast dash. Thrust, 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 thrust. Okay, we get damage. The nuke again. He did the good nuke. Even though I guess it doesn't matter with this kind of playstyle, I can't really hit him out of this anyway, unless I had reverse dash. But I do not, so we're not. Let's grab that. Extra bit of healing. Oh, uh, okay. I think it's big size, he hits you even if you sprint. Which is unfortunate. But that's alright. We get that active. Poke into these for some damage and get the slaps. We've got Heaven Sent again as well. Which I can use there. I was too early. But that's alright, he didn't choose the Shield Slam. So we can get up manually. There. Okay, you gotta wait for like the last orb. Otherwise you'll just randomly get hit. That's okay though. Fail damage check again. May as well grab that. Extra damage. He takes a bit here because he's in last phase as well. So he gets some more damage on his face while he tries to like fight off the Kyrio. Nice and simple like. Maybe finish him? Yeah, okay. That was probably the hardest one I've done. Just fighting my instinct of using the abilities that you're supposed to use. At least with this kind of playstyle. As always, here was my Gunlance build. It's just the comfort Gunlance set with no Hellfire and no Defiance on here because I wanted to get some extra guard so I could get guard 10. Using an attack boost 3, element exploit 1 with 3, 2 slots. As always, here are all the skills and decorations. Of course, all the green numbers are from decorations. If you want a screenshot there and there, you can. As always, with Gunlance, it's built around your comfort. So get the amount of comfort that you specifically need for Gunlance. And then go from there. But as always, that was another weapon without its wirebug skills and attacks. This time being the Gunlance. I thought it would be... A lot worse than this, but it was fine. It was just hard to fight the instinct of pressing the buttons that I'd normally press. As always though, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you on the next one.